Happy 50th birthday, CAF. Well done. 50 years of awesome knowledge and awesome support. Thanks for all you do for the city of Chicago. The next 50 years should be just as sunny. Since 1966, the Chicago Architecture Foundation has engaged over 10 million people. In 1966, a group of people got together, people who were interested in architecture, who wanted to save a house. It was a very influential building for the city of Chicago. CAF blossomed from the initial idea of saving Glessner House. The Chicago Architecture Foundation really started at the grassroots, and the volunteer body, the docents, really still are the core of the organization. The first formal docent class graduated in 1971. The training to become a docent is one of the things that I am most proud of achieving in my life. You spend uh, several months reading and writing and walking around the city exploring. We are geeky architect freaks. <laughs> we continue to really promote Chicago's specialness as a place to see the built environment really at its best. 1983, the Chicago River was not a very pleasant place to cruise. The river was seen more as an industrial highway. However, the Chicago River runs through a canyon of skyscrapers. And a docent named Bob Irving came up with the idea of hiring a boat. And the change that's happened since the first river cruise to the river cruises that we're giving now aboard Chicago First Lady. It's mind-boggling. It's amazing. CAF did have an important role in revitalizing the river and bringing attention to the river. In 1982, the New House Architecture and Design Competition allowed us to reach out to a whole new audience. We have mentored over 250,000 students. We've developed three educational curricula. We've launched design competitions like discoverdesign.org, and we've opened the ArcelorMittal Design Studio. So I started with the design competition and from then I went off to be an After School Matters student here. My second home was here in the Arsenal Middle Design Studio. Since Open House Chicago began in 2011, we've opened the doors to 446 sites around the Chicagoland area. CAF is the voice of architecture and design in the city of Chicago. We're proud of our role in making that conversation accessible to the general public. When people come to the city, they're always amazed by the level of architectural debate and discourse. And CAF has been doing that for over 50 years. We've been providing the platform for that dialogue. I'm very pleased to have been the president and CEO of the Chicago Architecture Foundation for the past 20 years. It's had a really exciting growth period, and we're looking forward to a very dynamic future.